Hi guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you a toner recipe that I'm making for myself. Now using a toner is up to your personal choice, but I use toner uh, because I have open pores, and when I use a moisturizer or uh, you know something like a hyaluronic acid, it just locks in the water. So I want that water to be something like rose water. Okay, so let's get into it. And another small quick tip is for people who are in hurry, for office people who don't have to do their toner, serum and moisturizer, uh, like if it takes you too long, you can just spray this water and, uh, you know, uh, just put on your sunscreen in the mornings. So for that, what you can do is you can mix your toner, your serum, as well as uh, something like hyaluronic acid, which I'm going to just show you. Uh, in a toner in a spray bottle like this and then use it that's it this is my spray empty bottle so the contents I'm using here are I'm um, having my Banjara's rose water to that I'm adding my hyaluronic acid hyalu gel most of you know this and uh, this is what I'm gonna mix now for people who have acne I suggest using few drops of tea tree oil if you don't want to buy this tea tree oil if you think it's expensive and you don't want to spend on this I have a cheaper alternative. You must have all seen this Patanjali's, you know, headache balm. It's just a roll-on balm. What you do is just get this. It's for 30 rupees. Empty the contents. Add, you know, probably depends, you know, on the strength. I would suggest adding one third of this, not more than this, because it's very strong. It has peppermint. It has camphor. It has ajwain. Uh, ajwain is unnecessary, but that's okay. It has. But peppermint and camphor, both of them, are, they kill the bacteria on the face. And the peppermint is also drying in nature. So for oily skin people, it's a boon. It's a cheap alternative. You should try it. It definitely gives good results. Uh, yeah, I'm going to mix up all this and then just spray it on my face. That's going to serve the purpose of my toner. I like rose toner because I like the smell of rose. Other toners somehow I'm not a fan of. Now, if you're a person, if you have a dull skin, if you have ashy skin, you can add, uh, say, suppose, another two spoons of apple cider vinegar. That is also awesome. I already showed you that toner in my natural, uh, you know, organic skincare routine. Yeah, so that's it. Try it and let me know how good it is. It's definitely hydrating. That much I can say. You probably don't even need a moisturizer or a hydrator. It, this itself is serving the purpose. Thank you.